Hi everybody. I hope you're having a great Memorial Day weekend. We just had another major, major downpour, but not so much, uh, not so much thunder and lightning. So Vaji's not <laughs> freaking out as much as he did last night. Um, I'm not sure if I'm gonna do. I went to see Craig the Record King today. I don't know if I'm gonna uh, be doing a finds because I have an, an idea for a podcast and I might be working on that. Um, but what I want to share with you, I was just about to make a frozen uh, fruit dessert with my dessert bullet. <laughs> now, I, I have a Nutri bullet and I use it all the time. I love it. But for the summer, Nutrisystem came out with this um, dessert bullet and it's, it really is such a cool thing that I had to share it with you. Now, what you're going to do is uh, freeze your fruits. I, I always keep tons of bags of frozen fruits in my fridge because uh, this thing is so easy and you don't add anything to this. Um, it's, it's just fruit. It's really fruit sorbet kind of is like what it comes out to be but you don't add sugar, you don't add anything. Like there are recipes that you can add like a, a tablespoon or two of, of uh, plain yogurt with your fruit and a couple of other kinds of ingredients you can put in but I like it with just fruit. So I'm going to show you how it works. It's a very, very cool. Here I have some um, blueberries. I have some pineapple, a couple strawberries, a piece of banana, my fruits, uh, a couple peaches, really fun. And you just stick them right in the chute at the top, okay? Very simple. And then you turn it on. Stick the plunger in, and out comes an awesome, amazing fruit sorbet type dessert. It's so easy and it's so yummy. Look at that. Is that cool or what? There you have a perfect sugar-free, totally fruit sorbet, and it's awesomely good. It's so yummy. Mmm, so beautiful on a hot day. So that's a dessert bullet. Isn't that cool? That's my latest uh, new little gadget, kitchen gadget, and I'm loving it so far. It's so easy, and all you do is take a couple of pieces off and rinse them, and you're done for next time. So. Awesome. And, and unlike the Nutribullet, which you have to continuously go out and buy fresh vegetables for, which of course you can't freeze, um, this you just keep frozen fruit in your in your freezer and you're ready to go anytime. So <laughs> really fun. So anyway guys, I might be back with a finds in a little while. We'll see. Otherwise I will talk to you on another day this weekend. Have a magical, mystical, musical Memorial Day weekend. I'll see you soon. Yummy. everybody and happy Saturday. Hope you're having a magical day. Uh, great start to your uh, Labor Day weekend. We are having horrible weather. <laughs> it's raining like crazy. Uh, but we're supposed to have a tomorrow supposed to clear up and Monday supposed to be beautiful. This is my uh, fruit. Mm. All fruit. Frozen dessert. Nothing but fruit. Awesome. Okay, I went to see Craig today, and I got these Hillbillies and Hatchets 13 movie set. Hillbillies and Hatchets sounds amazing. <laughs> we got Les ba Baxter, The Sounds of Adventure on Capitol. Uh, two records at Gatefold. This is a great record. I do have it, but this record was so minty clean. We got Vangelis, Opera Sauvage. Look at that. Beautiful. Love. Love, love Angelus. King Crimson Red. Beautiful. Uh, Enya. A great Enya record right there. Um, the Little Steven Project, Sun City, Artists Against Apartheid. It's a great record. Really great record. 
Richard Bermer uh, on the third extreme. Look at that. This is great. This is beautiful stuff. This is on Gaia. Gaia Records. Music for Happy Occasions. Paul Pankis and his orchestra. This has a great cover, but it's very strange because it is all um, Yiddish songs, which is really fun. <laughs> The Torchy 30s on Grand Award. Now, on one of the podcasts, I was talking about um, Enoch White's first record company was Grand Award, and this is what I meant by the uh, frame around it. This is a Grand Award, so very fun. To you on a Christmas, it's very fun. I think I have this. I'm not sure, but I couldn't let that go because that looks insane. Uh, Maddie Pryor and Tim Hart Summer Solstice, because Summer Solstice is coming up very soon. This will be fun. She was the uh, lead vocalist of uh, Steel Eye Span. And beautiful psychedelic lollipop, the Blues Magoos. Look at that. Beautiful, old, fabulous, psych, fun. Uh, it was good to see Craigie. And the weather stayed nice until I got home. It was uh, sunny until I got home. Um, I also got this great book, Mondo Exotica. Uh, this is by um, Francesco Ad Adinolfi. Sounds, visions, obsessions of the cocktail generation. And um, this is the book I was referring to last night when I did the spy uh, podcast. Um, shaken, not stirred, really fun. And um, that's a really fun uh, podcast. I hope you're enjoying uh, uh, all the new ones. And um, the app, the smartphone app is ready. It is, uh, you could have it on an iPhone or an Android. And it is, uh, the link to get your, uh, to get your app is sideshowtink.podbean.com slash mobile. Uh, forward slash mobile forward slash so you'll be able to get your app at that address so uh, put that address in I'll put it I'll put a link in the uh, in the description box so you'll have it mm. but it makes it very easy to access the podcast uh, you'll have a little uh, a pretty little app on your phone that says radio tank and uh, click on it and it, you'll just what will pop up is a list of the tracks of the uh, different podcasts. Just click on the one you want to hear, and that's it. You're good to go. So, this is so good. And it got really hot and humid just before the downpour, so this really feels good going down. <laughs> so that's it, guys. Have a magical, mystical, musical Saturday. I hope you have a beautiful Memorial Day. I love you all. Talk to you soon.